I told them I emailed them. You, you, you want me to check them before? Welcome to the regular meeting of the Development and Environmental Review Committee. The date is July 24, 2024, and the time is approximately 10.03. Can we stand for the Pledge of Allegiance, please? Ready, again. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you, everybody. We're going to do roll call. My name is Mike Rosales with the Planning Division. Brian Castillo, Traffic Division. Robert Smoker, Public Works Engineering. Uh, Juan Dominguez, uh, Water Department Engineering. Robert Castro, Water Department Environmental Control. Uh, Elizabeth Mora Rodriguez with the Planning Division. Ida Barreras, uh, Solid Waste. All right. Thank you, Ira. All right, so we're moving on to the, uh, is there any public comments, or items listed and not listed on the agenda? Do you guys have any comments about anything else other than your project? No. <laughs> We're going to move on to the consent agenda. There will be no separate discussion of consent calendar items unless a committee member requests that the item be considered in its normal sequence on the agenda. So on the consent agenda, we have item number one, which is approval of the draft minutes. And our recommendation today is to approve the minutes of the regular meeting of July 10th, 2024. Do I have a motion? Motion. Second. Second. All approved. Any denies? Motion passes. All right, now we're moving on to the public hearing items. Um, we have item number two. Elizabeth, can you give us the project, please? Yes, uh, the project is a request to allow an approximately 1,602 square foot addition to an existing church on a property comprised of two parcels containing a total of 0.46 acres located at 3358 Northeast Street within the commercial general zone. At this time, there is no environmental determinations uh, since this is just a preliminary application to receive comments. Staff recommends that the Development and Environmental Review Committee give preliminary review with no action required at this time. Thank you, Lupita. Did, you, did uh, the applicant have any you know, comments or questions that you want to ask that you're here? You can come to the podium. Yeah, yeah you can address us. Ma'am, oh, the podium right okay. there. Uh -huh. There you go. Well, Patsy, we don't have enough to pay for the parking. For calculations, mm -hmm. it's the bonus or something to do for. Yeah, we can look into uh so for the yeah for the parking you would just have to since this is a religious facility, it would be based off the um major biggest assembly area. Mm -hmm. So you would just have to provide your parking according to the large portion of the assembly area. So that's for footage. That's how you base off your parking. And if you um we can if you look at the chapter that we provided associated with the parking requirements, mm -hmm. uh, that's where I need to get that detail. I can go over that with you after the meeting if you want. That's everything. Okay. Thank you. Of course, come on. Um, Let me start on what, well, first of all, thank you for completing this uh, meeting. Uh, my name is uh, Sandy Komlapi, I'm the pastor of the church. Initially, when we started this process two years ago, uh, one of the things that the guy we were working with at the time uh, actually the statement of intended purpose for the extension. I don't know if you have that. Uh, I have um, copies with me. Uh, if that is going to be needed, then I'm happy to share that with you. That might be something that we need as part of the formal submittal. Mm -hmm. okay. with um because the in the preliminary application is just for preliminary review to get comments. Okay. So it will be probably needed when you do the submittal of the application for the expansion. Okay. At that point, then yes, we will definitely need that. Okay, thank you. 
And please excuse my wife is uh, doing an uh, online exam this morning, so I'm stuck with this guy. No, <laughs> no, that's fine. Perfectly fine. All right. And it was there any comments or? Uh, because there is a proposed kitchen, uh, the pre treatment by check review by environmental control will, will be required. Okay. And I believe I gave those comments. We gave those comments to you already about the building uh, for the uh, water department, correct? Yes. Thank you, Robert. Anybody else? All right. So um, <clears throat> the fire department asked me to ask you to go ahead and submit your application to them. They, they said they didn't have an application on file, therefore they couldn't provide comments. So in order for you to get a complete set of comments, you'll want to go ahead and, and, and get with them. Okay, and submit online. Elizabeth, there's a handout she can give you and she can walk you through the process or I can. I know. All right. But other than that, there's no uh, formal recommendation to move uh, just to any meeting for this time as it's preliminary review. So we're going to go ahead and adjourn. The next regular meeting of the Development and Environmental Review Committee will be held on Wednesday, August 14th, 2024 at 10 a.m. here in this room. Thank you, everybody.